Hey there guys, 3D Print Dude. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to export the G code from Orca Slicer. So maybe you have a different printer on Orca Slicer and you're looking to export the G code or save it. This is going to be the tutorial for you. Step number one is to obviously get into Orca Slicer. Step number two is going to be to get your print ready to print. Here's a quick file just to get us going. Step number three is to get your print completely ready to print, right? Obviously, you're gonna click on the prepare and do all these settings on the left-hand side. You know, make sure you have all your supports set in here. Let's enable support, even though this doesn't have supports. Then on the next tab, click on preview, and this is going to slice the file for you. And essentially, this is the G code that we need to find, right? And you can see the G code over here. It's pretty simple for this print. So up here in the right-hand corner in Orca Slicer, it says print plate, but that's only if you have attached your 3D printer via Wi-Fi or network, right? Say if you have a different printer and you need to upload it somewhere else, click on this drop-down right here on the left of that button, and it says export G code file. Click that right there. Then what we need to do is click on that button. It says export G code file. Click that button. Then you need to, it's gonna prompt up a file on where it wants to be saved. So then choose a, lo a location where you want it to be saved. You can save the file type as you want. You should name it, whatever you want, then click save. And that's how you export the G code in Orca Slicer to be uploaded somewhere else, maybe on a 3D printer or wherever. Hit me up in the comments if you have questions and please consider subscribing.